This is the great mosque in the city of Kairouan in Tunisia. And this mosque is the fourth holiest place in Islam. And so for the last 14 centuries, the relentless passing of the days has been celebrated by prayers. Before dawn, sunrise, noon, sunset, and in the evening. <laughs> The calls to prayer mark out the passing of time as the sun travels across the sky. But it's not the sun that's moving. What we are really observing is the movement of the earth through space. This is the ball of rock we live on. It carries us through cycles of night and day as it turns on its axis every 24 hours. A year is the time it takes to orbit the sun, and we have seasons because the Earth's axis is tilted by 23 degrees. To see how that works, we need to speed time up so a year passes in just 10 seconds. At this pace, we can see how the southern and then northern hemispheres are angled towards the warmth of the sun taking us through yearly cycles of summer and winter. All the rhythms of our lives are governed by how the Earth travels through space. And in Tunisia, in April, it's springtime. This is the seasonal flower market in Kairouan. And it's only here for two months of the year because that's when these flowers are in flower. And it's a beautiful example of how the, the structure, the clockwork of the solar system affects things here on Earth in the most kind of unexpected of ways. Because if our Earth's axis wasn't tilted by 23 degrees, then there wouldn't be any seasons. And if there weren't any seasons,